General Bryce Oligui Nguema has assumed the role of transitional president in Gabon following a coup that removed President Ali Bongo Ondimba from power. The coup, led by General Nguema and the military, took place shortly after President Bongo's victory in last month's presidential election, which the opposition labelled as fraudulent. The coup itself was described as bloodless and resulted in the dissolution of the nation's institutions, the cancellation of election results, and the temporary closure of borders which were later reopened. However, General Ngume's leadership has not been recognized by other countries and there is international pressure for him to outline plans for restoring civilian rule. General Nguema has promised to organize free, transparent, credible and peaceful elections, but has not specified a timeline, stating that a new constitution must first be adopted through a referendum. He has also expressed a commitment to creating more democratic institutions that respect human rights although without haste. The overthrow of the Bongo dynasty has been met with celebrations in Gabon, and while some elements of the former opposition are calling for General Ngume to relinquish power, many in the country appear supportive of the change in leadership. Several Western countries and organizations have condemned the coup, but also noted the irregularities in the election that led to these events. It's worth noting that this coup is distinct from others on the continent due to concerns about the credibility of the election that preceded it. General Nguema has engaged in discussions with various stakeholders and has been responsive to questions and grievances since taking control.